New Orleans Saints quarterback Drew Brees posted an Instagram on Thursday morning apologizing for comments he made on Wednesday about standing for the national anthem. During an interview with Yahoo, Brees said he doesn't agree with anyone disrespecting the flag by kneeling during the national anthem. Brees was responding to a question about whether players will kneel during the anthem to protest social injustice and police brutality, as Colin Kaepernick did in 2016, in light of nationwide Black Lives Matter protests. Brees cited his grandparents' military service as the reason for his beliefs. Brees' comments sparked outrage in the NFL and sports community. Most notably, newly signed Saints safety Malcolm Jenkins said in an Instagram video that Brees he should shut the F up, calling his comments hurtful. He said despite being teammates, he couldn't let Brees' comments slide. In his Instagram post, Brees said, it breaks my heart to know the pain I have caused. I would like to apologize to my friends, teammates, the city of New Orleans, the black community, NFL community and anyone I hurt with my comments yesterday. In speaking with some of you, it breaks my heart to know the pain I have caused," Breeze Post read. In an attempt to talk about respect, unity, and solidarity centered around the American flag and the national anthem, I made comments that were insensitive and completely missed the mark on the issues we are facing right now as a country. They lacked awareness and any type of compassion or empathy. Breeze said he wanted to be a leader and recognizes he should do more work to fight against racial inequality. I condemn the years of oppression that have taken place throughout our black communities and still exists today. I acknowledge that we as Americans, including myself, have not done enough to fight for that equality or to truly understand the struggles and plight of the black community. I recognize that I am part of the solution and can be a leader for the black community in this movement. I will never know what it's like to be a black man or raise black children in America but I will work every day to put myself in those shoes and fight for what is right. Breeze called himself an ally, never an enemy, and said he should listen more. I recognize that I should do less talking and more when the black community is talking about their pain, we all need to listen. Breeze's apology can be seen below, I would like to apologize to my friends, teammates, the city of New Orleans, the black community, NFL community and anyone I hurt with my comments yesterday. In speaking with some of you, it breaks my heart to know the pain I have caused. In an attempt to talk about respect, unity, and solidarity centered around the American flag and the national anthem, I made comments that were insensitive and completely missed the mark on the issues we are facing right now as a country.